Hey, what's up, guys, and welcome back to some more Totally Accurate Battle Simulator. Now, we did an amazing first ever YouTube live stream on Friday of this game, but unfortunately, it got cut short due to my mouse breaking. So, I've written down the different battles that the fans wanted to see that they wrote down in the live chat. So, I want to say thank you to those guys, and you can see their names on the screen now. You guys are awesome. Absolutely love to having you with me, and we're going to be doing those battles today. So I hope you guys enjoy it. Don't forget to leave a like, hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. And let's get on with it. Let's do this. So the first one up is all swords versus all shields. Now we're in Ancient 2 because it's quite a nice open area and it looks quite nice. So I don't really like doing it in simulation. But if the battles get too big, then we're going to have to move into it. So unfortunately, that may have to happen, but hopefully not. So, all swords versus all shields. So, let's do the shields first. So, what do we have? How do we want to set them up? We'll do ten of each. So, these are the first ones, down in the tribal era. So, we'll do ten of each, and we'll try and sort of layer them to make it seem a bit better. Maybe go from weak to strong might be a good way to do it. So, we don't have any more shields in that one. We don't have any shields in there. So medieval we've got the knights now they've got swords and shields but we're going to count them as a shield rather than a sword just to make it a bit more entertaining so let's put in 10 of those and they're a lot bigger than those guys those guys are tiny and then what have we got we've got ancient ancient have quite a few so we'll put those in as well 10 of them and 10 of these guys and this should get quite interesting. Do we have any more? We do. We have some Vikings as well. So let's put in the Vikings. There they are. It's a little bit slanted, but that works. And then we've got Dynasty, and we don't have any in Dynasty. So let's move on to the swords. We don't have any in Tribal. We don't have any in Farmer. We do have some in Medieval, though. We have the Squires. So let's put in 10 of those. And then we're not going to use the knight because we've put them on that side as a shield. And then we've got the king. So let's put in the kings. Put in ten of those. And I've gone slanted again, but that's fine. Viking. We don't have any in Viking either. And then dynasty, we do. We have the samurai. So that's pretty cool. We can put those in. So it's actually going to be 50 versus 30. But those 30 actually cost more than those 50 altogether. So let's get started with the first fight. Off we go. This should be quite fun. Oh, okay. I think the knights actually just took out the front shields. That was interesting. I mean, we can't really see what's going on. It's just a pile of bodies. But I think the swords are going to have it. I can't really see who's left alive. And uh, none of them. I was about to say I think one of them, but... None of them. So, the blues won, but by the looks of it, that's just the kings left. Which is kind of interesting, because I thought the samurais would have done better, better than that. Okay, so, just for the fun of it, because we've got the secret units, they do have swords as well, but we're not going to use any of those. We're just going to simply put in, if I can find them, nope, that's too far up, some cheerleaders. And we're going to put some cheerleaders, just 10 of them, on the side of the shields to see if that can help them win. So let's go for that. Now they're not chuck cheering at the moment. But now they are. But I still don't think they're going to win. Unless they can distract some of them for a while. And that king really... Oh, he's not really doing well against the cheerleader. But that's all we've got left is cheerleaders, I think. I oh know we've got one shield over here who's trying to grab on and he's now dead. And Wow, them cheerleaders do survive for quite a long time. They were all ganging up on that one. That is pretty cool. And this time we actually had one samurai survive as well. Now I don't like it, but it seems that in the new update, they actually put in where the camera shakes. That wasn't me doing it with a mouse, it's okay. But it just seems really strange, it's really off-putting. 
So I don't know if you can turn that off. We're not going to look at the moment. We're just going to move on to the next battle. And the next one is 50 potions versus one ice giant. So, where are the potions? They're down in the farmer, aren't they? Yes, they are. So, 50. Now, I don't really know. Do we do lines of 10 again? I suppose that's probably one of the best ways to do it. We'll try and stagger them a bit. Just because they might end up hitting each other too much. Go away. Get rid of that one. And... I've messed up again. There we go. That'll do. So we've got 50 of those. And now we're going on to the very big guys. The Ice Giant. Let's go. Come on, Mr. Ice Giant. Now, can they actually kill him before he gets there? He does fall over, but he is now hitting. So I think this could be quite close. If he decided to actually stand up. Come on, mate. All you have to do is punch him. No, get up. I swear he's just had a few too many down the pub. And they are now attacking each other as well, the potion guys. So that might get a little bit interesting too. <laughs> he really does seem so drunk. Look at him. He can't even stand up. And I, he lost. So the ice giant can actually be taken out by 50 potion people. Now I wonder... If he can still take out 25. Now what we're going to do is we're going to make it a bit fairer. Because I think he's going to win. We're going to take 25. Off of the front. Because then that way they can still have the range to throw. Without him getting to him too quickly. So let's go. They're throwing. And he is getting slightly confused. He has fallen down already. But he does seem to be getting a bit closer. And he's already taken out like half of them. So, I think they're going to win. Come on, mate. Get up. Oh, he just punched himself. What is he doing? I've never really seen the potion people put in such good effect sort of thing. Like, normally you use them and the people still just carry on. It doesn't seem to really do much. But I guess against these giants, they do actually do really well. Now, where is he going? He's just wandering off now. I think he's given up. He just wants to go to bed. Go on, mate. Where are you? No, that's not an enemy. That's a statue. Mate. Mate, that's a statue. Turn around. Dude, come on. You're really making yourself look bad here. Come on, turn around. No. No. Okay, I think he's just given up. I think he's stuck. I don't think we're going to get anywhere with this. Unless they can kill him, but that may take a long time because there's only a few left. Okay, well, he's not going to attack them. I think it's pretty obvious that they will win over time. So let's just stop that. And we're going to upgrade it a little bit more. So we're going to go back. We're going to grab some more potions. I really should have done this one before taking some out, but it's fine. We can put those in. We're going to go back to 50. Um, yeah, we'll put that one there. And then put another 10 in. And this time we're going to put in all three giants. So then we've got the tree giant. And I do like the tree giant, but you can't really see his face because he keeps covering it with a tree. But that's cool. Let's go for the samurai giant as well. Because he is probably my favourite giant. And let's see if they can win. Because this should split them up. So I'm wondering if they will still all fall down. The tree guy's down. Samurai's still going. Nope, Samurai gave up at the end. And I think they're easily going to win. The tree guy's just laying down. Okay, now he thinks he's playing football. And I think this is going to be it. Two left. Nope, one left. Okay, there were three left. There's now one. There we go. So I think, did he actually die? No, he is still alive. He just fell over. So they can't take down all the giants. But it was still an awesome battle to watch. So let's clear those. Let's move on to the next one. And the next one is Tree Giant. And they didn't actually say who they wanted me to put the Tree Giant up against. But one of my favourite battles is still the Tree Giant versus the Samurai Giant. And it... 
it's quite cool. So we're just going to go for that. And we might put in some small units later. But I just love how fast he attacks. And the fact that he always aims for the head. Just constantly in his head. Oh, that was a good block though. Good block by the samurai. And dead. <laughs> right to the face. I really do love that battle. That is still one of my favourites. But I suppose we also have to do the very fun halflings. Well, we could just put in loads of them. So we're just going to do lines of 10. And... Oh, I always forget that one more. I seem to like putting in 9, not 10. But let's move along. 50. And I've left quite a gap there. So we'll fill that in. Um, let's go for 80. And let's go. Boom. <laughs> they go flying. Look at that one. That one is just gone. Out of the park, mate. That is beautiful. He still attacks so fast, even in slow motion. Like, that's faster than some of the other units actually attack in normal speed. I do like them throwing themselves up in the air, though. And he won. And he even got one out of the park. So, he's awesome. I love the tree giant, but still not as good as the samurai giant. So... Let's see what's next. Knight versus knight. Now, we will do that and then we'll upgrade it as we've been doing with the other ones. And I don't know why I still click all the way up there for the knights and that, but we've got a knight. And we've got a knight. Let's go. Oh, okay. They just went in for a hug instead. That is the weirdest fight I've ever seen. They're just cuddling and just trying to stab each other in the back. It's like a nice little dance. They're not actually fighting. They're just having a little dance. How very sweet. And blue one. So because blue one, let's put in a cheerleader for the red. Let's see if that can help the red to win. I don't think it's going to though. Come on, red. You could do it. That's it. He's distracted. Get him. Come on. Yay, red one. So, he gets a cheerleader. Let's go. Come on. Who's going to win this one? This is completely even. This is completely fair. And the red just took out his own cheerleader. So, I can see the red losing. Well done, mate. Oh, no. He might get that one. It, nice. Okay. He evened it up again. But blue still won. So, let's just make this really awesome. Let's put in 10 cheerleaders on each side. And to be really nice to them, we're also going to give them one healer each. There we go. This should be quite a good battle now. With the cheerleaders, the healing. Who's going to have it? My money's on red, but yes, red took down the knight. I definitely went for the right one just in time there. And now he just has to take down these guys. Th he really is struggling to hit them though. Okay, he killed him with the shield. But that was a pretty cool battle with the cheerleaders. They're not as useless as I thought. But let's move on to the next one. And that is 10 Sensei versus 1 Ice Giant. So this is using the new secret units again. So we've got the Ice Giant. I like putting the Ice Giant in the blue one because obviously he's an Ice Giant so he looks better in blue. And also, Trident and Trident's colour is blue. That's how it works. We we do like using the blue. And then we've got Sensei. So 10 Sensei. Let's put them in a line. Now I like the Sensei because their attacks are really fast. As you can see, they throw loads of them. And it is pushing him backwards. So of course they were going to win. That was over a lot quicker than I thought, though. So let's reduce it down to five. Can five still push him back? They can. Okay. This is an interesting test, then, because they still won quite easily. So let's do three. Can three push him back? They can't push him back, but they can stop him moving forward, so they should still win. Although he is going backwards slightly. Let's go down to two. And two. 
Oh, it's, he is getting there. Go on, mate. Go on. Go on. Get a punch in. Just one. He didn't even get one. Okay. So, oh, no. One. There we go. Let's put in one. He's not going to be able to stop it. And he's going to die. We have to give the blue a win. There we go. Yay, you finally won, mate. Well done. You're useless. Terrible. Terrible representation for the blue team. So, the next one is going to be quite a big battle. We have got a sensei. So, let's put down a sensei. We have got 30 ninjas from the dynasty faction, which are basically just worse senseis. But, this is what the people asked for. So, let's put in that. I almost only went to 10 there. But, obviously, we've got the one sensei. So, that works better. So, what was it? It was Sensei and 30 Ninjas versus Free Shogun, which is in the new bit, if I can find him. There he is. So we have got Free Shogun. One, two, three. Then we have got 10 Samurai. Okay. Samurai is in this one, I think. No, Samurai is in Dynasty. Get it right. There we go. So we've got Nope, I almost did it again. There we go. Ten samurai. And one giant samurai. That's in the new one. I know that. And we'll put in the giant one. Now, I'm obviously rooting for blue. Because blue's better than red. Everyone knows that. So let's go. And I think we're going to lose. Unless he can get a good hit in there. Go on. Go on. Flip past the ball. No, I think Blue's going to lose. And Blue lost. Okay. I mean, we do have some nice flying people, though. Look at him. Doing a star jump while holding throwing stars. Very nice. That was a bit of a disappointment. I wanted Blue to win. So I'm just going to make sure Blue win. Off we go. Come on, Blue. Surely you can do it now. You've got three giant samurai. There we go. Not many people left now. Who's left? We've got one left somewhere, but... Oh, he was just laying down. Yay, blue one! Very heavily fixed, but blue one. So, what was the next one coming up? The next one is... Two tree giants and two ice giants on the same side. So, obviously I'm going for the blue team. We'll put them to the sides there, and then we'll put the tree ones between them. There we go. And they are against 40 Sensei. Now, I can imagine 40 Sensei absolutely destroying them, so I should, probably should have done this the other way around. But, it's fine. We'll just fix it again if we have to. That's how you get ahead in life, isn't it? You just fix things. 40 Sensei. Two Ice Giants. Two tree giants. Go. And they are easily going to win. They're just pushing them all backwards. That was over way too fast. Okay. Um, do you know what? As soon as I said I'm going to fix the match. There you go. <laughs> go get them, guys. Go get them. Because the thing is, they're being pushed back. But they're also being pushed forward by their friends behind them and we should easily win this one even though it's lagging slightly I may have overdone it going for the blue team although they can't actually get these last few people they can't actually get through their own friends dead bodies to be able to get them come on I don't know who's left I think we've got is it just this guy in here yeah he's still going and he died and that doesn't surprise me seeing as he just got bundled on by a ridiculous amount of ice giants. But that is a pretty cool battle, that one. I like that. Let's get rid of those. We didn't really fix it. Honest. Okay, so the last one we're going to be doing is five shoguns versus ten samurai giants. So that would be pretty cool. So, what do we have? We have... I cannot find them. Five shoguns. Five shoguns are in this bit. There's the shogun. One, two, three, four, five. Let's space them out a bit. And then ten samurai giants. 
Samurai Giant is next page. There we go. Samurai Giant. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We can fit them all in. Off we go. I do like how fast the Shoguns move. But they're no match. Oh no, they are still alive. I thought they were dead. Okay, they're still going. I'm really confused what's happening right now. Everyone's just flipping. Stop it. Kill them. We do have some dead, but we have some dead on both teams. But I think... Oh no, we still have these two. And we have one red left. Still got the blues. So at least I finished, hopefully, on a blue win. Come on. As if he's still alive. As if he's still killing them. Come on, guys. He is really strong, that Shogun. He is not giving up. There we go. He finally died. So, I hope you guys liked that video. Thanks for watching it. Don't forget to leave a like. Hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.